What is up everybody? Welcome to another video. And today I'm gonna to be reviewing or comparing rather um the Nike Spikes versus Nike Waffle Flats. So I made a video on this. Um it actually has like a thousand views, and I also made a video on this. So these are dragonflies. These are uh I forgot honestly. I'm gonna put the name up on the screen. Anyways, I'm gonna be comparing um the looks, the feels and stuff. Now I did run these in cross country. And I ran these in track, but I'm going to run these in cross country and then I'll make another review. But all right, so I'm going to start by going off the basic features of each shoe. So I'm going to go Dragonfly first. Okay, so you have your Nike logo here. Other side, Nike logo. The foam goes all the way up to here on the inner side. And on the outside, it goes up to here. So um, inside, you have Nike Just Do It. And then these laces are um, grooved, so they uh, come undone less often. Yeah. And then you have this lip, and then on on the lip to school, you got a dragonfly. And then on the bottom of the shoe, you have your Nike logo, this plastic thing with like grip and stuff. Um, you have this plastic blue plate on mine, and you have your six different spikes. So we'll go into the um, the victory ones. Pretty sure that's what they're called. I'll put the name up again. So these ones I wore in cross, so they're a lot more messy. Inside, um, XC, the sole. Um, on this side, in the outside, you have this much foam. On the inside, you go up to that much foam. You have your Nike logo here, a big Nike logo. And then you got a smaller Nike logo right here. These shoelaces are not gripped like the Dragonflies are. I actually had it on, come undone while I was at uh, Griac Race. The material is, I'm pretty sure it's waterproof material. Anyways, the bottom, you have all these grooves and stuff. But it's not like a spike, so it's not going to be grippy and stuff. Yeah. Right, now I'm going over the pros of each shoe. The pro of this shoe is the shoelaces do not come undone unless you didn't time, right? There's a lot of grip because of the spikes. Also, uh, when you go off your toe, it feels, feels like you can push off a lot more than with these ones. Um, I also like how um, like aerodynamic it is. It's, look at that, very, very nice. It almost feels like a Pegasus. It's super comfortable. And pros for this shoe are, it's um, waterproof. Uh, there's no spikes, so you don't feel spikes. I never feel spikes in um, my dragonflies though. So that wasn't really an issue, but for, for like other spikes, if you don't have dragonflies, you can feel your spikes. I feel the spikes in, but you, these, you don't have to worry about that because there are no spikes. I also like how like breathable it is. This shoe is very, very good. So I'm gonna go on the cons now of the Dragonfly are, there really is no con to the Dragonfly in my opinion. I don't see a con to it. Uh, it's, it's like the perfect racing shoe in my opinion. I do have a couple cons about this because it has no spikes, there's less grip. So we had a lot of mud meets. So when I would go through the mud, I would slip and stuff. Never actually fell but you can't get like that grip and, and power off of your run. So that's one thing. Another thing is up front here, seems very tight up right here. So that's another card. Right, so I'm gonna go over if it is better to have spikes or not in your shoes. So in my opinion, it is better to have spikes, but you need to get the right pair of spikes for you. These, personally these are like, with these, you feel the spikes. It's actually just, it's a terrible shoe. I'm gonna be honest, these are terrible spikes. Uh, I do not like them at all. I don't like the material or anything. So I think spikes are better. You just need to get the right ones for you. Although the waffle ones are always great to start out with. Like if you really don't wanna try spikes, try waffles, you'll get a good feel for them. Um, I would not suggest wearing waffles on a track though. That's something I wanna do. I usually, last year I wore tempos instead of uh, waffles on a track. So I only wore these for cross. But I wear spikes now and my times have gone